This is Denver 7 On Demand. Hi, I'm Molly Hendrickson with the latest from Denver 7. The 2018 legislative session is set to wrap up at the state capitol Wednesday. This year, lawmakers were able to accomplish something that forced a special session last year. A huge transportation bill is now headed for the governor's desk. But there are still a few major things to get resolved. The public employee pension program known as Paris still needs an overhaul. And lawmakers still need to take action on sexual harassment legislation. A new study on our state's population shows Colorado's growth is starting to slow a bit. The University of Colorado says fewer new residents are expected to move here this year. The influx of newcomers hit an all-time high in 2015 with 68,000 new residents. This year, that number is expected to drop to 60,000. Delta Airlines is apologizing after a plane had to evacuate as soon as it landed at DIA. Flight 1854 from Detroit was taxiing when passengers say smoke started coming through the vents. Five passengers were treated for minor injuries, but right now there is no word on what caused that smoke. And now from the First Alert Weather Center, here is Lisa Hidalgo. And it's going to be a gorgeous day today. Yesterday it was sunny, it was warm. Today a little different. We'll see a bit more cloud cover than what we saw yesterday. Clouds coming in from the west, but still a very nice afternoon. We should be in the low 70s, low to mid 70s between 11 and 12, and then upper 70s with some low 80s this afternoon between 3 and 5. So our temperatures are still well above normal. Uh, today mild through tonight, partly cloudy and 60s by about 11. Now tomorrow it's going to get even warmer, mid to upper 80s expected on Thursday. The winds are going to pick up. It's going to get gusty through the afternoon, especially in the mountains, and fire danger is going to be a lot higher on Thursday. By Friday, things start to cool down. Now, as we head into Mother's Day weekend, we're tracking another storm, and this one still looks like it's going to bring a chance for some scattered showers and highs in the 60s, so a little cooler and wet for the moms on this weekend. Molly? This has been your Denver 7 On Demand update. Thanks for joining us, and make sure you check back here later today for another update, and download the Denver 7 app for breaking news and alerts. I'm Molly Hendrickson.